Hi, I'm Eddie Montserrat with HMY Yacht Sales. Today, we're in Casa de Campos, Dominican Republic. This beautiful piece of land is home to one of my latest listings, a 2001 80-foot Azimuth. This boat has been meticulously cared for by the same owner and crew since the moment it hit the waters from the factory. Some of my favorite features of this yacht include an inviting flybridge, four stateroom layout, and sleek lines which make her stand out when anchored at sea. Let's start this walkthrough at the belly of this beauty, the engine room. She is powered by twin 1400 horsepower 3412 Caterpillars. Power to the boat is supplied by twin Kohler generators, each giving an output of 25 kW. As we make our way out of the engine room, you will notice a crew quarter with two beds, dinette, and galley that accommodates your captain and crew. Directly above the crew quarter is the galley. This galley is perfectly set for your chef to cook all the family's favorite meals. Forward of the galley is a dinette that comfortably seats eight. Downstairs, we have a four stateroom layout. Starting forward is a VIP stateroom, which is housed by queen berth, closets, and its own full head that makes this the ideal stateroom for your favorite guests to be completely comfortable. As we move aft, you'll notice there are two guest staterooms. On the port side, there is a fully function stateroom which can resemble a VIP with its full head. Now, on the starboard side is a guest stateroom with bunks suitable for a single adult or for the kids to make their little home. All the way aft is where the owners find their safe haven, the master stateroom. From a huge walk-in closet to beautifully set head, this full beam master has everything you need to really make this room as homey as you'd need it to be. As we make our way from downstairs back up, we find ourselves at the lower helm station. Here at the helm station, you'll find a leather dash pad, a leather bench with adjustable center seat. The navigation equipment in here consists of Raymarine chart plotter, Raytheon ST80, Raymarine Pathfinder, and a Shipmate VHF. Leaving the helm station is the salon. At the salon, you'll find a built-in curved sofa to port and starboard, built-in chair, and a burl wood table between. Here in the aft deck are where sunset dinners are most enjoyed. A beautiful dinette which allows seating for six. Just after the deck is a swim platform, making one of our last stops of this walkthrough here at the flybridge. This flybridge is the ideal spot you want to be on sunny days as views are unobstructed. You can easily find a seat for yourself and your guests, whether it's at the U-shaped seating on both port and starboard, or it be at the bar where you can enjoy a drink or two. Your chef can find his place of magic here at the grill. Want your captain in on the beautiful weather and energy upstairs? No problem. Wrapping up this tour at the bow, a huge sun pad where sunbathing is crucial and probably the only activity you'd want to do here. Thank you for coming aboard this walkthrough with me today. If you have any questions or if you want more information on this vessel, you can find my contact information in the description below. Thank you.